We are what I, what I believe is cutting edge. Across the country, there's really basically two types of philosophy that you can go with. And one is you can teach mechanics and teach up into the lowest common denominator, i.e. trying to make every single umpire out there consistently doing the exact same thing. My philosophy is actually the opposite. I believe we should take the guys who are on the bottom half of a conference and force them to be able to learn and run the mechanics that the upper half are capable of doing. That will make sure umpires get better and that they won't stay stagnant. When you're talking about conference staffs, it really is a numbers game. And quite frankly, there are way more umpires out there than there are slots available for those umpires to work. So thus, it's important for these umpires to keep coming to camps, to keep getting trained, because if they don't, there will be someone who is not on a conference staff right now that's going to be working hard and working and get better, and they are going to end up on a conference staff. It's already happened this year. We've already had a, we've already had an umpire right that there. came to a camp this year that Can wasn't on a conference staff. He came and showed that he was capable of working in that level. An opening came up, and he was placed on the conference staff. And it's not only just them becoming umpires, but them also becoming teachers and mentors and trainers. I mean, it's that thing of, I like to be able to be the one that sits back and says, you know, look what he's on, you know, five years ago, 10 years ago, however long it was, he was coming to these camps just trying to be, you know, just trying to become, to learn and become an umpire. And now that person's the trainer, he's the teacher, he's the mentor, he's the one that's out there teaching the, the next one. You have to have that continuous cycle where umpires develop themselves and then go out and develop other umpires or it ends up, basically what ends up happening is the whole program ends up dying. What we're trying to build is a sense, it's an incentive-based program which gives a sense of competition involvement now. Something that quite frankly has been missing out of this area for a long time. And what we're trying to accomplish is that every slot that gets assigned is a slot that's earned. Thus, we want the umpires realizing that if they're not going to get better, if they're going to sit there and stay the same, then they're actually going to be getting worse because there's going to be someone out there that is trying to get better that's going to earn that slot before they will.